Alright, hello guys, I'm Ben Horse. So, uh, since the last video, I haven't updated my video for a long time. Uh, I got something to do, so I'm sorry, but here am I might. And this time I'm trying to make a tutorial about uh, gear enhancement or equipment. Uh, let's go see. So, what you want to do is first you, have, you need to have money right here. Um, as for a uh, trade between the players. And you got to go to the market. Uh, it's right here in the map I got to put this on it's right here or you'll go to the other map it's called Typhoon it's right here no oh yeah right here and so gear enhancement you have to find it on here and put the password in and uh, you got to find that this is for weaponry and uh, armor and those for the um, I don't know what it's called but it's for the uh, Rings and uh, necklace. Yep. So all of those can have gear enhancement. Uh, look at mine. So in PvP, uh, if you see those, that means a uh, gear enhancement or equipment enhancement, whatever you call. So uh, if you are d depends on your class, depends on your class, you have to choose the uh, benefits to you. So in last time, I introduced the uh, five properties here, and some of those. Some of the properties can directly add into your here. Uh, I don't know what this called, but it's like uh, five basic properties. So that's five basic properties, and this is like the the five properties to add into your um, combat party. I would say. So let's say if you need a, a weapon, a major weapon, primary weapon, and you can search it, you can see it here. You have to spend some money to buy those, and I recommend uh, for primary weapon. I recommend to use um, this uh, accuracy, uh, which is really helpful to your uh, dungeon fighting. But also you can build on others, such as uh, this, this uh, defense defense right here for PVP. So it all depends on your what you want to choose. And this little number six here, it means the quality. Uh, you want to choose. Uh, uh, the level 4 quality and you can upgrade to 7 or above no actually only 7 only 7 so also you can find some more expensive one that have a uh, double quality double quality like here and uh, for this one uh, accuracy one it's really expensive and you want to save money to buy this you have money uh, this is really helpful and also can be upgraded if you want to upgrade this you have to go to uh, here upgrade and uh, slagging this one here. So the first one I put this in is for uh, upgrade the first one, the first line of property. This one. Oh, I don't know actually. I do I show my show my mouse? I have to check. Out. So if I didn't show my mouse, I will just put a mark in my video later. So the second property you see here is use this one. Uh, so the way to upgrade the the second property, you have to put other gears or equipment that have uh, uh, enhancement, and the total quality combined had to reach 27. And yeah, this one's high. Uh, so that's basically about it. And you see the purple one here. The purple one you spend a lot of money to get this. And if you are really into this game and you want to do something really well, on uh, some part, you can buy the purple one, but it's really expensive just to make sure. After you have the purple quality right here, uh, it's harder to upgrade the first one and the second one. So if I put this one here, you have to use uh, this. Um, I don't know how to call this. You have to use this to upgrade your first quality or enhancement. And this one is cost a lot also. So that's uh, basically about it. So what I re recommended is for your head, your, your hand, I would say and two rings and um, and your dart and uh, primary weapon to go for the accuracy after you have that you have enough accuracy you can go to the uh, critical damage for second one but it costs a lot of money also uh, not not as much as a purple one this is much cheaper actually and or you can do for the double accuracy it costs a lot too but not as much as a purple one and since the last video, I remember um, 
someone asked me, uh, the book build for the for Gen with no with no golden books. So, if you want to play PvP for Gen without gold books, uh, it's kind of hard because uh, it's hard to get your um, get your how do I say this, defense up. So, but the first one you want to choose uh, is uh, where is it? You, the first one you want to choose is called Shaputi, and I can't find it where it is. Oh, right here. So this is the first one. The second one is uh, Xiao Tian Zhen Yue. Uh, this one, and it, it helps you to recover recover the defense bar, and also help you to build up your defense. And the third one, this one. Uh, actually, the most important two is Xiao Puti and Xiao Tian Zhen Yue. But the third one, I don't really know how to choose. But you can, you may choose this one. It, it gives you a uh, how does this HP, and after your HP is low, it helps you to increase your damage. And I remember some people choose that for PvP in the earlier versions. Other than that, I don't think any of those are important, but you may choose uh, Sanjie Xiu Luo. You may choose this one. It's not really for PvP, but all other books, it's not that fit for PvP. Um, and this one can help you to, um, I would say, kill someone when they have low HP. And other than that, that's about it. And thank you for watching my video.